Hey everyone, today I'm going to open these two Jurassic World baby dinosaurs. Now I know technically this one is not a dinosaur, this is a pterodactyl, which is a flying reptile. So please excuse me if I do call it a dinosaur later in the video, I, it might happen, alright? But I know it's not. Alright, so we have the pterodactyl and we have the Tyrannosaurus Rex baby. Okay, so these are electronic with motion and sounds, and if you see these in the store, you can test them out. Uh, you can do like that, and you can do like this, and we will check out, we will check these out later, uh, what all the things that they can do. I don't know if they make more sounds than that, that might just be a test mode, but let's take a look at the packaging first of all. Okay, so Tyrannosaurus Rex, it's got some information about this one on the back. It's got some warnings and some more information down here. Let's see, it's made by Hasbro. It takes three AAA batteries, which are included. Included. And uh, let's see, it's for ages four plus. And on the bottom, it shows the other ones in the series. There's the pterodactyl that I'm going to do today. Also the Triceratops. And on this one, on the bottom, it shows the Stegosaurus. Now I've done the Triceratops and the Stegosaurus in another video. If you want to watch that, just click right here. Uh, but today we're doing the T-Rex and the Pterodactyl. Okay, so is there anything else on the back of this one that's different? It looks kind of the same, except for, of course, the word Pterodactyl. Instead of T-Rex, let's see, on the bottom, it says they're sold separately, and it tells you it comes with instructions, and here is the barcode, and that is for the pterodactyl, here is the barcode for the T-Rex. Okay, let's take a knife and see where some tape is. Let's see. Okay, we have a piece of tape right here, and right here, and when you cut those two, oops, I think you still need to cut, nope, no more tape, that's it. Alright, so this comes apart pretty easily, like that. If you are a collector and you don't really want to mess up the packaging too much, let me cut the other one in the same fashion. Okay, I thought that was already cut, but it's not. Alright, so we just unfold it like that. Okay, now there is another piece of tape on the inside. Now we're just going to cut there and there. And always be careful with sharp objects. Have an adult do this. If you are too young to be using knives. Okay, we have the Tyrannosaurus Rex instruction. It does a roar with the finger. Oh, there's an on and off switch. See, right now it's in uh, like a sample mode, kind of. Try me. So switch it to on to activate play. It will turn off in about a minute, if you stop messing with it. There's where the batteries go. It's got some battery information. And it's got some different languages. And uh, some more stuff right here. Okay, oops. And here is the other set of instructions for the pterodactyl. Looks to be about the same. It also shuts off in about a minute. And it also comes with batteries and lots of instructions in various languages. Alright, we've got some string twist ties, which I kind of like. Uh, they're pretty easy to take apart. So we have one T-Rex out of the packaging. Let's move that aside. And 
then let's take the twist tie off of the pterodactyl. And let's get him out also, or her. Could always be a her. All right, we've got them both out. So, here they are from the side. Oh, look, they've got a little, this one's got a little tag. This one does also. Okay, so let's take a look at this one first. We've got the nice Jurassic World logo. These are covered with cloth, but they're kind of hard on the inside. And you can feel that there's some moving parts and joints and things. Let's see. Okay, on the tag. Um, we've got some information there, and a number. Okay, we've got some Velcro to cover up the battery area. It, it needs a screwdriver, I mean, a, a, yeah, you, you uh, could use a Phillips head or a flathead screwdriver with that one, I think, maybe. Small. And it would come apart like that, but we don't need to do that because it already has batteries in it. Close that back up. Bottom of the feet are sculpted fully, very nicely, and even painted. Look at, there's brown paint on the green feet. Also, the nails are painted. And he's got a nice brown stomach. He's got soft cloth fingers. And, oh, he's got his little plastic teeth, or her teeth. It's a, kind of a light pink on there, and a little bit darker pink on the tongue. Two different colors, plastic. Nice, clear, shiny eyes with a, kind of a red colored paint in there. And even some white, it looks like. Let's see, I can't really move the eye, but you can see white in there. And there's a little, kind of a pink colored area around the eyes. Uh, there's a lot of stitching involved on this toy, so it has a nice shape. Okay, that is the T-Rex. And here we have the Pterodactyl. See, he's got this nice crest on his head, or her head. A little bit of white right here, I don't know if that's on purpose. Let's see, if you spread the fur apart, is it white? Yeah, it's white on the inside, so... That is pretty neat. It's got spots, kind of, I don't know if they're painted on there, or if it's printed in there. But there are greenish, uh, darker brown green spots, and kind of a reddish brown spots on the yellowish brown fur. So it's a very multicolored, nice quality fur, and oh look at the cute wings. Didn't know they spread apart that wide. This one also has spots, if you can see them. There's kind of a dark green and a brownish color. And this one has a texture. If you can see there's kind of scales uh, imprinted into the fur. This one also has the scales, if you can see the light shining differently on the scale shapes. There, it, the, the fur is actually shaped like that, like it's stamped into there or something. Um, nice sewing on the back. It's also got a tag right here. And a number. Okay, the bottom of the feet on this one are also sculpted. And it looks like there's some paint, just a little bit of paint on there. The toenails are brown. Um, they're pretty hard plastic. It's slightly bendable, but pretty firm. He's got brown on the beak right here. And the inside of the top of the mouth is not pink on this one. But he's got the same pink type of tongue. And he's got some taste buds, I guess. And you can hear him starting to chomp. And let's see. The, this color 
is a little bit different than this color. It's a different fabric right here. This is smoother and doesn't have multicolors. It's got a little hand fingers right here. And of course his, his other finger would be going down along here. Let's see. He's got uh, kind of a regular cloth on the inside. It, it's stretchy. And on the other side also. This part is just cloth. It's very soft. Okay, let's... Uh, oh, and also the Jurassic World logo. These are embroidered in. Okay, so one last try in the test mode. Now let's put them in... The normal mode, let's see. Okay, try me is this way and Oops. Wait, just close that back up. And let's do this one as well. Let's see. Oops, it goes it's opens this oh it's like a flap. And there's a cat. Okay, so let's turn this on. Oh! Wasn't expecting that noise. Okay, also with this type of thing you can kind of tuck the tag in, I think. And just stick it inside. Close it back up. Okay. And this one you can do the same thing if you want. Put the tag on the inside. Alright, now let's see what they do in, in full play mode. Okay, how about you? Okay. Alright. Do they do anything else? Let's see. Well, he's pretty active. Does this one do anything else? Okay, now we've got... Okay, you need to be quiet for a minute. Okay, so this one just made a different noise. Okay. So He seems to do a variety of things. Uh, not quite sure how to make him do it. He's very cute. If you put your finger in his mouth, you always make the chomping noise. Or the eating noise. And he kind of bites down a little bit. Like He's actually attaching himself to my finger. And he only lets go when he's chewing. See, he's got my finger now. It's pretty cute. Alright, let's try this one here. Okay, what do you do? What about if I pet you? I think the T-Rex is jealous. Did you go to sleep? I think he went to sleep because I wasn't messing with him for a minute. Alright, let's, let's try this one just a little bit more while that one's still asleep and being quiet. T-Rex, you got any more noises? Eh? Rah! You don't like that? You don't like that? What about this? Oh! I don't like that either. Alright. So let's put him over there. Okay, it's time for him. No. Uh, what if... Okay, that's how you turn it back on. If you want to turn it on, just touch the tongue. He's awake now. Yeah. Okay, so let's pet you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 
All right, well, he, he seems more quiet now than he was when I was playing with the T-Rex. Anyways, okay, so let's try the mouth stuff. Are you gonna open up? This one's pretty cute. Also, his eyes are green. I really like this fur right here. Looks really cool. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. This this one's I like this one a lot. Cause this one's cute, but it doesn't really look like a T-Rex. I don't think it looks more like a weird lizard, or uh, maybe something. It kind of looks like something from that TV show Dinosaurs, the uh, the one with the live the live action puppet kind of things. But this one's really cute. They're both cute, but I like this one better. All right, so let's turn them both back on. Let's see. <laughs> he burped. Does this one burp? Oh. Ah, look out. That sounded like a purr. <laughs> this one doesn't have a tail. What kind of? So these are these are pretty fun, especially if you have two of them. Uh, I'm sure they're even more fun if you have the Stegosaurus and, and the uh, Triceratops. But uh, these two are great. Look at that one. That one's so cute. And the T-Rex is cute too. Alright. I hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, you kind of learned what these do if you have them out of the packaging. And out of the store test mode. They're really cute. Look at that. Adorable. So, I would recommend picking these up if you see them in the stores. You like cute little baby dinosaurs and uh, little baby flying reptiles. Let go! <laughs> Alright, see you later!